Hi, Mike. Hi, guys. That's right. It might seem a bit unorthodox to get married at this lovely outdoor mall setting, but people get married in weird places and the heart wants what it wants. For example, I didn't know this, but Justin Bieber actually got married on a boat. There you go. See? And that's Justin mm -hmm. Bieber. So six couples so far are going to be taking the leap, the nuptial uh, walk off the plank, today right here at Crocker Park. Uh, and they've made it very pleasant and very nice. And we are right in the middle of this uh, marathon of getting people married. And I actually got to talk with the last couple that just took the dive the, uh, just recently. Take a listen. Uh, why did you guys choose Valentine's Day? My theory is to say that you only had to remember one day. Is that it or no? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's about as good a reason as any, I think. <laughs> Why Valentine's Day really? Tell me. You know, we were just engaged for, God, how long? Like a year or two? Two years. Two years. Yeah. And we just thought, you know, we've waited so long. We might as well just go for it, you know? And I'm so happy that we did. Yeah. Have you always had a special connection with this day? Yeah. No, no, with this day, not really, no. But just, now you will. Now we will, Absolutely. yeah. We'll never yeah. forget our anniversary. Absolutely. <laughs> That is very convenient. They will never forget their anniversary. That's right. That's this is right. Karen Hirsch. You are overseeing all of the all, the whole marathon here today. I am. That I was am. couple number four. How's it going so far? It's going very well. Yeah. People you, are very excited to be here. About how many couples have you married over time? Uh, I'm approaching 200. Nice. So, yeah. You know, Do you know what your batting average is as far as success ratio? <laughs> I, I don't know. That's I, right. I, I, I assume they're all still together. I don't want to. I think they're all still together. Certainly they are. Absolutely. Um, you, can you tell at this point, you've seen four couples so far today. You have two more couples to, to marry up. Can you tell at this point, some of the couples are like, I have a lot of uh, faith in this one. And then some of them are like, mm, we'll see if this works out. No, no. I think everybody who 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 comes, I, I see it as everybody who, who wants to be here, they're here for a reason. Yes, so. at least at that moment, they're very much in love yeah, and, yeah. And, and sincere. What do you yeah. think, based on having dealt with all these couples now, what's the what's the key to a good marriage, you think, based on these people? Oh, oh my goodness. Who the seems key, to be happiest? Uh, I think people who communicate well. Yeah. Uh, you know, I think that's important. That's the key? Uh, communication and appreciation for each other. This has been a special event so far. They do it right here. It's very yeah. nice. We're in a nice facility here. We actually saw that they gave a nice gift to the last couple uh, from um, Whimsy Willow. Yes. Uh, one of the stores here. So they're, they're like treating people nice here, right? Yeah, yeah. There's a uh, gift package from several vendors here at Crocker Park that they give to the couples who get married here today. And then there's a grand prize winner of uh, a package from Hyatt Place that has a overnight hotel stay, wow. massage for two other gifts. Very nice. nice. Might, Very nice. Hey, might as well, if you're, gonna get, if you're uh, destined to get married anyways, exactly. you're determined to get married, right. might as well maybe get, some, get pampered a little uh, yeah, bit. Yeah, absolutely. Well, thank absolutely. you for your service and for absolutely. bringing love to everyone in the greater Cleveland area here on this Valentine's Day. Happy I'm Valentine's happy. to you. Same to you. All thank right. You. We have more happy couples getting married here, so we got to clear the altar, folks. Back to you guys. <laughs> Mike.